Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to work out the variance from a frequency table. So to do this I'm going to use the formula shown in the red box. And it is sigma fx squared divided by sigma f. Minus in a bracket sigma fx divided by sigma f. And close your bracket and square it. Um, sigma means sum of and f is our frequency and x is our data values okay so let's have a look at the example here so we've got to work out the variance for the ages of these 10 people okay so our age will be x and our frequency is f so the first thing I'm going to do is work out sigma fx squared and sigma fx. So let's start off with sigma fx. Okay, so we can do that by multiplying the first two columns together. So 9 times 2 is 18. 10 times 2 is 20. 11 times 5 is 55. And 12 times 1 is 12. So if we add this column up now that we've just worked out, that will give us sigma fx. So 18 add 20 add 55 add 12 is 105. Okay, so we're now going to add another column on and we're going to work out f x squared so we're going to square the ages and then times it by the frequency so our first one would be 9 squared which is 81 and times that by 2 which is 162 so our next one would be 10 squared which is 100 times by a frequency of 2 which is 200 our next one would be 11 squared which is 121 and then we've got to times that by 5. So that gives us 605. And our final one would be 12 squared times 1, which is 144. So if we add this up, this will give us sigma fx squared. And that is... 1111 okay so the other thing then is sigma f which is given in the questions so that's just the total of our frequency column which is 10 so we can now put these our numbers into the formula to work out the variance so we've got sigma fx squared which is 1111 so we've got to divide that by sigma f, which is our total frequency of 10. And we've got to take off in a bracket sigma fx, which was 105, divided by sigma f again, which is 10, and that is squared. So it, if you've got a scientific calculator, then you should be able to type that in as it appears now on the page. Okay, so we've got 1111 divided by 10 minus 105 over 10 squared. And we get an answer of 0 0.85. So that is our variance for the ages of the 10 people in the table. So... If you like the video, make sure you like it and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, guys.